Hey, what's up, everybody? How's everyone doing today? Doing well here. Again, thank you for asking. I have another movie review to throw out there for you. The movie is called The Arrival. It came out in 1996. And I do have, once again, my trusty notes. I am not a professional reviewer. I just give you a quick little overview of the movie and my humble opinion. <clears throat> so, let's get this started. It stars Charlie Sheen as Zane Zeminski, Lindsay Krauss as Elan, Ilana Green, Ilana Green, Richard Schiff as Calvin, Ron Silver as Phil Gordon. And I didn't know he was dead. He's actually dead. It is directed by David Fawhead. T W O H Y. Good name. I like it a lot. <clears throat> so the story goes as Zane discovers an alien signal. Beep, 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 beep. That kind of signal. He reports his findings to his uh, boss, to his colleagues, to his people. And he is quickly fired. That's weird. After a little investigating, he realizes his place of employment is hiding deadly alien secrets. Now he must find the truth to help clear his name because they framed him like, you know, Roger Rabbit. They framed that mother. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so now he's got to clear his name. Poor guy. So first, let's talk about the use of CGI. <clears throat> this was in its early days, of course. Now, we all know Jurassic Park came out before 1996. I believe it came out in 93. And its CGI still holds up today. So this isn't true for every movie. But, for this movie, it's still in its early stages. And it shows it uh, with the alien uh, type um, beings that we get to see. Um... However, it shouldn't bother people because it's it's done well enough that it's it's decent. It's not like I did it. That would be bad. Um, yeah, it shouldn't bother you unless you have little sensitive girly eyes, which I do not. My thoughts on the movie are as I'm not a big Charlie Sheen fan, <clears throat> but. That plays no part in my review. I'm very forgiving of those things. His acting is very sheen. So it's nothing new. The movie seems to flow pretty well. And that's good because it's almost two hours long. But it goes by pretty well. It's not bad. Sheen plays his part pretty well. And his character gets into some action scenes with humans and aliens alike. Um, Zane, played by Sheen, he seems to be beaten uh, at every turn uh, by those trying to cover up the aliens, uh, the alien secrets and that. <clears throat> every time he thinks he has a, a heads up on something or, you know, whatever it Someone, uh, the guys seem to get ahead of him and destroy evidence or do this or that. So, uh, does he win in the end and get the message out of alien life? I can't tell you that. But I will say, it's a constant struggle. There is some invaders of the body snatchers. You'll kind of see how that plays out. Uh, this movie has 
some good set design and the areas where they film look good and are convincing as such. It's a lot of deserty type uh, looking area and then office buildings and stuff stuff. So it, it all they all do a good job and and the cinematography looks pretty good and everything everything's done fairly well. It it looks like a low budget movie and it might be but with having Charlie Sheen in it, you know, uh, I don't know. I see I didn't watch it back in the 90s, so I don't know if it was a big time movie. I don't know if it was popular or looked at as such, so I really don't know. But it's done fairly well. <clears throat> the side characters uh, they all seem to do their parts and feel like they have purpose and that's always good you don't want a bunch of dumb people just standing there uh, are there plot holes and mistakes I'm sure there are every movie has them uh, the deal with me is I don't just sit there and focus on that I don't look for it now if something just pops out, out at you just you know and hits you like a hammer that's one thing, but I don't sit there and look for these things and try to analyze like a lot of people. I don't do that. So, uh, I give this movie a super solid 3 out of 5. I think it's worth a watch. It's decent enough, uh, especially if you like Charlie Sheen and some of these other actors that are in there. Um, it is decent enough to sit down and... Grab you some popcorn and watch. So, I thank you for watching my movie review. <clears throat> Hope you like my channel. Subscribe, comment, share, all that good stuff. And don't forget, you can get up, get out, get rad, and do it to it. Even doing a movie review. We'll see you guys later. Peace.